We are here in Phoenix, Arizona at the hotel room of Nick. So, Nick, is this your own suite? You got your own place all by yourself? Uh, yeah, I like to call it my palace. I mean, it smells like uh, not a man's locker room, like actually a men's bedroom because it's like full of cologne and stuff. And I got my hats everywhere. And it's my own little place. I'm liking it right now. Yeah, so your mom was cool. She's like, just travel by yourself, get your own place, yeah. have friends over, have a few drinks, kick it. Yeah, I mean, the... The people at the, the kiosk in, um, in the airport, they weren't too happy with it because I was an unaccompanied minor. But uh, I got through it. Uh, I pulled out the bills, and they just put a smile on their face, and they let me go through the gate. You just so, threw them a couple hundreds, and they're like, cool, cool, cool. I was like, oh, you want to be a friend Benjamin? <laughs> My homie Benjamin Franklin says it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> all right, so what's up, man? How are we liking Arizona? You like the heat, the weather, the girls, the pools, everything? Well, right now, the heat, it's definitely really hot. I mean, eventually I'm going to get used to it uh, because actually one of the dancers said that it gets, it feels really hot on the first day, but the like the next two days, it's just, it's nice. But I um, uh, haven't seen the girls yet, didn't really explore. But I saw the water park here and it had a lazy river, and like mini putt golf and like a big, huge pool with volleyball. So it looks fun. No, you even get a chance to do all that because you guys have a busy day, right? You're teaching people for a music video tonight. You have classes tomorrow. You have a premiere of the video tomorrow. Yeah, so um, I, we don't know if we're ever going to get the chance to go in the pool, but hopefully we do because we want to have a good time, not just like be locked up all yeah, the time. Yeah, yeah. But it's still fun to do, like doing what you love, to get up, dance every day. And now we're doing something different. Uh, we're doing a music video with the fans, so it should be a lot more fun. Now, P.S., we're kind of stuck in this room because you, the only only iconic boy that would do this, but you look outside your window, the fans saw you, and now they know your room. Yeah, they know my room number now. Um, Come on, Nick. I'm going to be locked up in here. <laughs> we're going to have to sneak you out the back. Put a blanket over your head. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. You're, you're always so nice to your fans. All right, so can we can we do a couple fan questions, speaking sure. of fans? All right, before we start with the fan questions, you have to say, what's up to Anya from the Philippines? What's up, Anya from the Philippines? And you have to say her Twitter is Kaylee96. Uh, your Twitter is Kaylee96. Yeah, she didn't give her name, unfortunately. But she said uh, she'll make you pancakes if you say um, hi to her. So hopefully Kaylee96. Oh, will. hi, Kaylee96. <laughs> hopefully she'll make you some pancakes. Yeah. All right, so say what's up to Bailey from New Jersey. What's up, Bailey? Uh, what's your favorite thing about the summer? Um, I just, I like about the summer is that there's... There's more activities to do, and it's more outdoor activities. It's not just locked up in your house, like playing video games or watching TV or being lazy. Like, you actually get to do stuff. I mean, you can, like, play basketball, play baseball. I mean, I sometimes even play hockey. Um, it's just it's a better season of the year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it because you guys get snow and everything out there, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, say what's up to Kelly and Holly from New Jersey. What's up, Kelly and Holly? All right, it's breakfast time. What do you order? What's your favorite breakfast food? Okay, first on the list, bacon, egg, and cheese on a croissant or a bagel. Doesn't matter. And then, you know, you got to get the hash browns on the side, of course. And then and just sip it all down with um, some orange juice. Orange juice? Mm -hmm. Now, you like pulp, no pulp? Mm, doesn't really matter to me. Sunny D or real orange juice? Real orange juice. Thank God. I, I thought you were going to say Sunny D. That's like orange Kool-Aid. <laughs> All right, say what's up to Kenzie from Cali. What's up, Kenzie? All right, what is your favorite song right now? Uh, right now, wow. Um, I actually have some on my phone. I don't even know where my phone is. Uh, I like a lot of house music, so I like all that weird stuff sticks in the middle of the night like roof, yeah. roof, roof. raven you know yeah, yeah. <laughs> um right now uh around the world by uh bob, okay, yeah. bob sinclair yeah, yeah it's, it's a really good song all right cool they got to check that out say what's up to uh nicole a from jersey what's up nicole a all right you only you have a million dollars but you can only you only have a day to spend it what would you want to spend it on okay first a house and then a nice car and then some nice clothes you know all that stuff some nice shoes make sure you're all good and of course you got to support for your family so like all the, the like all the rest of your money goes to your family and they can play around with it i mean do whatever they want 
Okay, I like that family. You're going to be broke, but, uh, yeah. you know, giving it all to them. But that's yeah. good. All right, so last fan question. Say what's up to Natasha from Ohio. What's up, Natasha? If you had a fires at your house and you had, you could only save one thing, besides, like, family and pets and stuff, what would you want to save from your house? Um, wow. Oh, this is a good one. Uh, well... Of course, family first. You got to say family first. No, 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 but besides your family and stuff. Because, of course, you'd save, like, family yeah. and pets. But if you could only save one thing in your house. Oh, wow. My phone. Your cell phone? Yeah. Okay. Grab that and then run out. Yeah, because it's got all my music and all my contacts, all my games that I can play. So it's like my laptop in one little device. So I just pull that with me and run out. Okay, I like that. Now, one thing your fans really want you to do is go to the Philippines, but um, Tracy didn't teach you any uh, words, but we just taught you. So can you say what we yeah, taught you how to yeah. say? Yeah, I forgot that. So um, how, how do you say that again? Mahal kita. To all you iconics. Mahal kita to all you iconics, which means I love you in Filipino. All right, good. And now you just had an article written about you. Um, so tell me a little bit about how that came about and uh, what you wrote to them and just the whole experience. Uh, I mean, a lot of people reached out to me and I started to do these like interviews like through email and eventually I'm going to do some like live interviews. But um, like it's, it's about just like how I'm becoming like the next star or like the, the next like upcoming kid. And I just explained, like, how it all started and how dance, like, made me express myself and get me where I am today. I heard they saw, like, your interviews here and they liked you and they reached out. So that's a good thing, right? We gonna get, yeah. We're going to get that 10% or what? Yeah. 10%, 15%, like 20%, 30 Okay, 40%. Yeah. Cool. Okay, we got that. 50%. All right, half and half. Okay, cool. No, but so, okay, it's cool. So when you, uh, when you get asked questions like that and stuff and you sit down and you write your answers, like, are you, like, serious? Like, tell me a little bit about that process. Well, um, I just, I take it more on a serious note to explain, like, to, like, explains to them word for word for like what happened how it started and where i am now and what i'm doing so i like to take it more like serious but too, also you too. have to have fun with it too yeah yeah yeah. throwing a few jokes and stuff and we single we still single yeah still single oh come on man what's going on mm -hmm. you got too many ladies after you yeah you know you can't be you can't it's be hard down. to just like sit down and just rest on one person all right, and then lastly, um, let's see. Okay, so I've been asking the boys this. Mikey had an answer, Madison didn't. Is there something that you've never told anyone? It doesn't have to be embarrassing or anything, but is there something going on? Or like a, a, We've never asked you before, or like a secret, or something about you that people don't know that you want to tell everybody? Um, ooh. Um. Like something people don't know, like... I don't know. Do you have like a favorite? Do you like to smell something? Do you uh, do something before you go to bed at night? Do you weird food, weird song you like? Um, um oh, weird song I like. Okay. Um, actually, like some of the boys, I like I like joke around with them, and I listen to the song, and because it's like a it's like a like a stupid song, and when you like, and if you watch a YouTube video, like the people dance around crazy, and it's. I think it's called Horseplay, and it's like, yeah, it's a weird song, and just... Can you hum some of it, or...? Uh, I can't hum it, but, I mean, I, I have I have it on my phone. If we'll have to look it up. We'll have to look it up. Horseplay, we don't know who it's by? Uh, no. Wait, the best part's coming up. <laughs> I feel so like catchy. this is something like Snooki and uh, J Wow go yeah. into at the clubs. Like it comes on and they're like, "It's that horseplay joint." Yeah, that's so crazy. <laughs> that's that's why it's stupid because it's like Jersey Shore, Jersey Shore style, and like everyone jumps around and dance like an idiot. Yeah, yeah, basically. <laughs> All right, so anything coming up that you want to talk about or? Just dancing. What do, you, what do you, you know, the tour, unfortunately, is coming to an end, and it's not starting again until next year. What What are you going to do to keep busy the, the rest of the year? Um, I mean, I'm definitely going to do try to do more of those interviews, and uh, I'm definitely going to try out, um, you know, try to bring more videos out, like dancing videos, possibly singing videos if I'm ready. 
uh, more acting videos, and just all that in one. Okay. Somebody's at the door. We think it's a fan, so we'll take it out. But all right. We've been here with Nick, Nick Mara, and uh, it's been good talking to you, man. It's been good talking to you. Say what's up to all the Iconiacs that came out to Phoenix. What's up, Iconiacs? Thank you for coming to Phoenix. Thank you for coming to support. And we hope you like the show. All right.